Hello! This is a quick video showing how to get the Behringer X-Touch 1 mouse track selection working with Reaper. It is not perfect, but if like me, you need to select tracks with the mouse, this setup might be useful to you. I have it set up already, and as you can see, selection tracks with the mouse works fine, but now the channel buttons are basically unusable. And they just keep bucking out and being weird. Unfortunately, this is an issue a uh, Behringer will hopefully fix for the next firmware update, but we never know. So, to counteract this problem, I have bound the track selection buttons to be function buttons 1 and 2, just by using the Reaper actions. This works well, but of course you will be losing two of your function keys for this, so just bear this in mind before doing any changes to your setup. Now, for the setup itself. Then, press the stop button and push down the encoder to enter the mode menu. From there, select the Mackie standard mode, so MCSTD, and then press the encoder two more times to exit the menu. There you have it. Mouse selection should now work when you restart Reaper. Unfortunately, you will have to use a standard layout for your X-Touch and configure the function keys yourself. But the buttons that do work out of the box are the transport functions, the wheel, the marker, cycle, the click, and solo clear and all the buttons in the top row. The function keys you will have to assign yourself to whatever suits your workflow. That's it. Thanks for watching.